Okay, the favorite, the famous and infamous at the same time, maximum security, uh, blamed for uh, nearly causing a calamity in the Kentucky Derby, uh, and also praised for running a strong race and being able to overcome uh, having his heels clipped. It all depends on who you ask about this horse, but he's back. He uh, made his return since the Kentucky Derby in the Pegasus Stakes. He was beaten by King for a day in that one. So he's got something to prove now. Maximum Security was undefeated coming out of the Kentucky Derby. Uh, the only loss he's got on his uh, uh, career is that second place in the, um, in the Pegasus Stakes. So that makes him uh, five out of six. He's uh, he, he obviously you gotta like this horse. Um, I think the jockey kind of fell asleep. I think he could have probably won in the Pegasus Stakes had he ridden him out a little bit stronger. Um, but uh, perhaps, and maybe just perhaps, he doesn't have that speed. Um, he hasn't gone, you know, under even time since uh, running seven furlongs, uh, you know, a, a ways back. Uh, the Florida Derby was decent, you know, uh, mile and um, eighth and uh, 148. In Kentucky Derby, mile and a quarter and 203 and change. Um, but perhaps maximum security, he's good, he's strong, but maybe he's just not as fast as we think. Now, we really don't know. He had uh, two more terrible workout times, as always. They always work him out to be pretty much the slowest horse uh, on the track of the day. Uh, his last workout was a 53-second breezing uh, four furlong. Uh, that was 17th out of 17 horses running. Uh, the one before that was another 53 seconds, 67th out of 68 horses running. So obviously the trainer, Jason Service, doesn't like to work this horse out hard. Uh, that's part of his strategy. I guess maybe he, you know, whatever. It's been working for the horse. He's uh, won every race he's been in except for one second place finish. We expect him to be out near the lead or on the lead once again. So that's what's going to make this pace so hot is because so many of these horses want to take the lead. Somebody's going to have to back off or else they're all going to get tired. And a horse like Everfast will be able to come in there and just steal it away from him. So we're going to have to keep a close eye, of course, on maximum security. I think everybody's keeping an eye on maximum security. He's probably the horse that all the other jockeys are going to be watching coming out of the gate to see what he does. Um... So, hey, Saya just got his work cut out for him. He's going to be the favorite. Uh, I don't think they're going to uh, um, bet uh, King for a day or Muto Gusto down before him. I expect maximum, maximum security to go off as a pretty strong favorite. But uh, he's not going to just be able to walk away with this one. He's going to have to earn this win just like the rest of them. These other horses are just not going to give it to him. Uh, they're very hot-headed. Um, the, the jockeys out there, are, are, some of them are hot-headed, and they're going to want to get a, a, a quick pace going. And so he's going to have to have his work cut out of him. Like I said, you don't want to go too fast. don't want to go too slow. Or else we're going to see how much uh, stamina maximum security really has. But we know he can be beaten. He's been beaten by a horse in this field before. So uh, we've got to watch and see. That's what makes this so great.